shot. Up, oh, that is in! Murray with the win! On the campus of Missouri s and in Rolla. It's at the Gail Bowman or Gibson Arena. I will do my best to, if you can hear me, I apologize. I'm hoping the audio is working. That's stolen by Stillville. And third attempt is no good. CJ Tilgen with the rebound on that. Three offensive rebound attempts by Stillville. Arnett, it's his first, first foul of the game. I think the stream is working on its way to catch up here. Dixon still with the ball. Three-point shot off target, offensive rebound. That's blocked, blocked again. Dixon still with the ball. We have a foul. So three quick fouls for Stillville already now on that possession so far. And Dixon can't get the drive. Stillville in the way. Sold out crowd here at Dixon High School. They have people on the stage filling that. The team has scored so far. Thank you for joining us at Dixon. Kiljan drives. And Dixon the first one to get on the board. Dixon won championship already this year. They were Frisco League tournament champions. They defeated Licking in a close ball game. So they have championship under their belt. I believe, not sure. That is picked off. Stillville the other way. Basket is good. Harris with the bucket. Dixon underneath. Tilgen kicks it across. Young decided to pass it back up again. Another kick out for a three. They're going to pass up on that. and drives and again Dixon trying that's Rome he'll take it he'll kick it out for a three it is short into the Stillville Cardinals hands and Stillville we have a time out I can't really fix a whole lot of that Out of view, Stillville with the ball. Nearly lost it, Stillville still hanging on. They won by them, really. Half court. Oh, it is Stillville basketball. Looks like that might have been off Dixon earlier, but it's hard to tell from up here. Good in the air. Stolen by the car. 
Cardinals one on one. Dixon rebounds. That was Landon May with the good effort there. I believe CJ Tilgen on the defense. That's stolen from Tilgen. That will head the other way. Diaz. Part of that and still no now leads 10 to 4. I'm not sure if the scoreboard is correct here. Yep, the scoreboard is not correct. Three by the Cardinals. That is good. 13 to four now. Nine point lead. Stillville, Stillville played Dixon earlier this year, and they were victorious in Stillville. They usually play one of the first games of the year. Cardinals, three-point opportunity, short into the Bulldogs' hands. That is down first quarter. Still a very competitive ball game. Dixon held to four points in the quarter so far. Stillville, 15, Rome looking to make that seven, but can't get well, Former track runner of mine, can't pronounce his name. That's a shame. Both these teams met in last year's district title. A matchup between the one and the two seed. Nearly picked off by, still picked off by Dixon. Basket other way, it is blocked. Do apologize for the stream, that is beyond my fixing at the moment if it does glitch out a little. But this will be somehow redone or something here. I'll figure it out if it does have issues. So that three off target, still Dixon ball. Stolen though, underneath. It's going to be Rome's second foul of the game. So both free throws were good. 17 to 6. Final 20 seconds to go. Three point play. Not there. Rebound Cardinals. Is Mullen with the rebound? And to come back. Quick break in between the game right there, and Stillville 17 to 6, 11 point difference. Dixon can't get the layup into the Cardinals' hands. Sold out crowd, the stage nearly filled up already here. I think the crowd is quit funneling in. Stillville is not ready to settle down. They are wanting to increase this as that'll make this a 14 point game. Dixon will respond on their end though. Three of their own for the Bulldogs. And 
Gilville again with the three to come back on that. It's sent off target, ball, basketball. So officials timeout, no timeout charge to anybody. And they'll add another to that. 25 points now for the Cardinals. Full court pressure by Stillville. Dixon, jumper. It's good. off by the Bulldogs. They have help underneath. They'll take the fake. It's good again. Ten point game. Three off target. Dixon again with the rebound. That is Drake Young with the Defensive rebound underneath, assist, basket up, not most likely tomorrow. Picked off by the Cardinals, other way. Foul for Dixon. I believe that's the first for Young. Stillville again with the free throws. They're hanging out ahead just really by free throws at this point. Well, was some pretty decent shooting there, but both teams had a hot streak going. It's keeping Dixon in this ball game. And speaking of hot streak, Bulldogs, they'll cut this to a single digit difference. Big time ball game here, folks. Stillville underneath, that is short, offensive rebound is good, 11 point game. in there. Still nine points. Dixon again pressure by Stillville. CJ Tilgen. He'll try to drive himself. Can't get the layup. Cardinals hands. They are trapped down there but they'll get the ball away. Dixon two safety in the first half. Tested inbounds. Is tipped out of bounds. Stillville for two, just short. Rome out to Tilgen. Tilgen will kick it to the corner. Three is good. Six point game now here. Dixon 23, Stillville 29. So Stillville in the white. And that tip, no good.
Mixon underneath in traffic. So far, both these teams really keeping the pressure up. First free throw, no good. Both teams now in the bonus. Both free throws off target. We're going to have a... A bit strong, but off the glass will go in the bu uh, basket there. CJ Tilgen, another opportunity coming for a free throw. It is five, now it is four. And the second game could be another Stillville team, or it could be Dixon, but the winner of this game will face Thayer. Thank you, STE Communications. They've been around locally owned for many years and well over 50. Still go with the bucket. We'll have more information on that for the game there. Falls asleep every once in a while. Still a little shovel pass for three. Not there. Rebound Dixon. Bulldogs try to pull it out, but he has continued to be double teamed. Three-point shot. No good. Rebound. I believe that is 32, and the score is good. That is Bryce with the rebound and the bucket. Back to nine. And assist underneath, can't get the layup. Deep three, that is sh you don't tell them no on that. You want to take that shot and send it. If it'll go, it'll go. Daniel Light, a junior. And Bulldogs at the line. So one more free throw to go. First one was good. And second one also good now. It's a seven point ball game. Actually a six point ball game. Sometimes the math don't work. Three Cardinals off, offensive rebound, and foul on the shot. Still a very competitive ball game here. Carson Mullen, free throw, good. That is, I think we've had a possession longer than 10 seconds, so we may have two possessions coming still. And they're going to run this down to about nine or less. And as I mentioned, two possessions, shot, off target. We'll get the ball first. Cardinals in the white, Dixon in the red.
Stillville with the bucket. A little bit of cleanup underneath as several players had to get out of the way. That is Rome. That three's off. And that is stolen by Stillville. Stillville. As you can get. Dixon passes up the three. They're going to take this one. And this one will fall. Bulldogs eight point game now. Stillville still on top. Foul on CJ Tilgen. Waiting to make sure that was the right foul. And that's going to send Harris to the line. He's going to miss the first. But he'll make the second. Nine point difference. Tilgen will fake it. Dixon looking for a three. They're going in there trying to draw the quick foul. And they did. First free throw, no good. Matthew Barnett at the line. This is a rematch from last year's championship. A lot closer than last year. So one of two for both of these teams. Stillville, that is short into the Bulldogs' hands. That is off target. This year's Basketball State Championships, Wilsha.org, and all games will be streamed on Misha.tv also. The next round of this game will be on the at the Gibson Arena on the campus of the Missouri University of Science. And the winner of those, that drive, that's blocked. The winner of those will wind up playing in Southwest Baptist University for the semi or the quarterfinal game. It'll be against a Southwest Missouri program. Dixon with the bucket, seven point game, six point game. Never mind, it's, I think I'm right and I think they're wrong. Yep, yeah, I'm right. It's six points. I... Problem is, Dixon's normally white in this gym, so... Still, though, we'll make it 41-33, though. That's Young driving. If, the f oh, that, if that foul is right, that is on 15 Wyatt Harris's... So both free throws good again. And Cardinals once again making a quick basket. Halfway through the third, it is still a close contest. Still single digits, just a hair on the Stillville side right now. Dixon with the three. Trying to cut into that. That would have cut down. But Dixon with the offense. Ball loose. Stillville basketball. Stillville passed up that. So eight points will turn into nine. Stillville hasn't been in single digits since the first half. Or double digits. 
And they will make this a double digit difference again. Dixon can't get it. Offensive rebound is good. Bulldogs still still in this game. So Stillville passed up a three to begin. And three looks on target. It is off. Of it's a dangerous pass. Dixon able to hang on to it. They will kick it out for the corner three. Instead, they'll drive underneath. It is intercepted somewhere in there. Is brought down by Dixon again. Tip in the air is good. And out of bounds, Stillville basketball still, but very good play. Do have a clock adjustment, the next dead ball. Game clock about 10 seconds off from what I have. And Cardinals with the bucket. Two shots off. And a mouse glitching out a little bit. We'll try to get... There we go. We're back. Definitely a mouse glitchy. Still a little set shot is good. One nineteen to go in the third. <laughs> Further down the floor. the three back to the Cardinals nearly kicked it stolen Dixon the other way so 30 seconds Dixon ball still nine point game separate the two three is good by Young six point ball game Stillville can't get it. Dixon brings it down. And shot off. End of three. 49 for the final period here. Final eight minutes here. Winner will move on to face Thayer. The other team will end their season. have number two on my roster so I can't give a hundred percent percent of who that is and in trap 
fake, I believe it. Four point difference in the second quarter. Don't hit my camera like that. Don't do well. Dixon. Tiljan basket up. It's good. Inbound cut for a score. Four point ball game. Cardinals, two of their own to make up for that shot. Three, not there. Stillville ball. So Stillville will make this an eight point game now. Back to back layups. Tildjian basket, he'll take it all the way, it's good. CJ Tildjian, four point ball game now. Stillville, again under pressure, foul. Pulling the timeout. Inbound backcourt just off camera. Basket is good by the Cardinals. So Stillville really pounding the inside. It's kind of their game plan. They're a decent sized team. They're able to get underneath. They'll stretch this back to eight once again. So Dixon got within four. Stillville brings it back to eight. Dixon's going to need to get a score here. That is blocked on the way. Stillville. So I don't know if this is two or one, but we're going to have free throws. It's going to be two no matter what. This is probably the best ball game that you have can probably watch in the area right now. There's a girls championship going on over at Lakeway tonight, however. I bet it ain't as I bet it may not be as competitive as this one. Of course you got Newberg and Dixon over there, which two very good girls programs. Get off. Under four minutes in the game. Stillville with the ball still. They have a 10-point lead. They can't, they can't hold the ball, but they don't want to shoot a shot like that and give it right back to Dixon. Because eventually Dixon... Again by the Cardinals. Ball on the ground. Oh, 
Free throw off target by Dixon. tip is good. So Cardinals now beginning to take a lead. Three up. It's good. Full timeout. Dixon will be back in one Dixon needing to get the ball back. Not a lot of time remaining here as nine points. They can hit a couple shots and get back in this. But Stillville will extend this back to 11. Dixon gonna have to score nearly every possession. And Tilgen will help have that happen so far as another nine point game. Pressure, Dixon. That is going to send Harris to the line. Inbounds. Nearly made it. Rolled in and out. Stillville with the rebound. They're going to slow down. A minute and a half remain in this contest. Dixon stolen foul. So back here, one and one. One thirty-three to go in the game. Dixon first free throw is good. That'll make this an eight-point contest again. Dixon been in striking range. They've hit four points both times, but quickly Stillville has extended that. Dixon may have to resort to fouling pretty soon here. Stillville spreading the ball. And leaving a mismatch down there. They'll quickly get back into it for the Bulldogs. One minute remaining in this contest here. Stillville. Dixon going to have to foul. Dixon, they need to score on this drive, get the ball back, score again. They don't need a three basket, no good. The winner will face Thayer, 7:45 Wednesday night at Missouri University of Science and Technology in Rolla. Limit yet. Stillville needs to play good defense. Three up off target. Offensive rebound. Tilgen basket. Can't get it. Rebound Stillville. Dixon needs to foul. Trying to foul. To end the season for a team, and Dixon should be proud of this one. So with that, we will end this final score here at Dixon High School. 67-55. Thank you for watching. It's been a great ball game here. Hopefully you enjoyed it.